hi guys welcome back to the channel hopefully you guys can hear me um i just want to come in with a quick little life update and tell you guys why i have been mia for the last couple months um you guys know that you know the kids were out of school for summer and all that so i really just took time to enjoy the kids um we went on vacation we went up to the smoky mountains um that was amazing i loved it i definitely want to go back uh we saw a bear um so yeah we did that um and then here the last part of summer we all got corona my mother included and she has been battling that for the last month and she's still trying to get over it um the nurse did come by to our house yesterday and she told me that she didn't hear any congestion like still down her lungs but she still does cough with that you know phlegmy type of cough Although she does have the congestive heart failure, and that could be, you know, some of the reason why she has some of that um, congestion down there. But, you know, before she got the corona, I didn't hear, I didn't hear it that bad. Sorry, hopefully the lighting's not too bad. I didn't hear it that bad. So, um, yeah, just, you know, keep mom in your prayers. Um, she is starting to eat because at first she wasn't really eating too much or nothing. Now she is just on insure and um, I can get her to eat ice cream, but anything solid, it's a no. Um, although she's getting, she is getting a little bit better. So hopefully uh, she will go back to eating solid foods soon. She does have a birthday coming up here tomorrow. So hopefully, you know, we'll have some family come by and that will brighten up her spirits and she'll, you know, eat some of the party foods that we do have. Um, I'm I'm gonna get some of her favorite stuff. My mother loved Chinese food, so I'm gonna get some Chinese food, and um, oh, my sister's gonna get the Chinese food. I'm gonna get the cake and all other stuff, and um, yeah, we're going to have a little family get together at the house this year to celebrate her 81st birthday. Hopefully, we will, you know make it to 82 that's you know what every birthday i'm just like okay can we just make it to the next one <laughs> so um blessed to have made it this far though so um yeah but she's she's doing better um she's getting her strength back i mean that corona for her knocked her totally off her feet she couldn't even walk anymore so it was so so bad so she's getting back to trying to walk a little bit not as good as she was but she's definitely on the men. Hopefully we'll get, you know, our stamina back up to where we can walk um, like we were. And she is getting up, getting, you know, sitting up and stuff herself now. So that's good. Yesterday she told me she was ready to go shopping. So that's always good. She want to, you know, she want to get in the streets. Um, so, yeah, hopefully um, she is going to get back to herself soon. Um I was just looking to see if the store was open. I'm running in here to get my my mom her her birthday cake. But um yeah guys, not too much here um going on in the late in the most recent days. Um as far as finances go, it hasn't been a good third quarter for us. Um we had some expenses come up. My daughter had to get braces, so I we had decided not to get her braces because her teeth you know they they were okay like she you know she didn't have major like gaps or anything in her teeth um but she it turned out she had like wisdom tooth or teeth that were in the back that wasn't gonna come in they were like pointing downward so she had to get the braces to um push the teeth forward and um so they can come in and they can get those out so yeah, that was a hit to our our savings. But um, you know, we are just kind of pivoting. Hopefully, um we can increase our finances a little bit more and continue to, you know, be on our path to paying off our debt and financial freedom. You know, you know, it's a struggle. I know everybody's going through something. Um, but yeah definitely my goal is to get to be financially secure 
for when I am an older woman like my mother and I can, you know, I want to get my, my medicine, my food <laughs> and have my housing. That is just the goal. I don't need a lot. I just need that. And so, um, yeah, I'm definitely thinking about that now and trying to get, you know, everything in place. Um, so yeah, guys, um, I do have, um, I'm, I'm studying for a new certificate that I'm going to be taking the exam for here, um, hopefully in, in, um, in November. I was going to do it in September, but I pushed it back. So I'll tell you guys about that, um, a little bit later. That'll, that'll help also to boost up the income. Um, so yeah, guys, um, just, you know, just trying to get back on track after this corona this last month here has been horrible so that is my little life update you guys please pray for my mother to um give her her strength back and and keep her with us another year um so yeah guys i'm not gonna hold you guys up i am um gonna run um i'm out here looking a hot mess again um i don't have on any makeup uh if you guys know me in real life you know that i I do I'm a makeup girl and I do like to wear my makeup I don't always go out with like a full face of makeup but I do like to have on a look you know a little tint and you know natural look um although I do sometimes get mistaken for being like much younger by younger people which I love but no I am not I have I have kids that are I have my kids in my um in my 30s and I have a 14 year old so listen <laughs> but I'm always happy for the compliment and hopefully I can continue that, you know, with good health and exercise, drinking water, whatever. Um, so yeah, guys, I'm not going to hold y'all up. Uh, hopefully, I hope you guys can hear this and I didn't block the microphone with my hand. <laughs> All right. So I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.